It's Kellen from Wizard Tricks. Hope you guys are having a good one. The next one is going to be on butterscotch. That is the next ingredient we're going over. And I have to say, this one may be my favorite. All the other stuff is like blood and liver and like weird looking things. This one is butterscotch. I eat butterscotch. This one is good. I would just eat it before it ever goes into the potion. Um, but this one is uh, basically butterscotch. Um, butterscotch and it is used in the dwaddle draft um, potion and we're gonna get into that in just a minute but of course the butterscotch is what makes this particular potion have a very sweet scent which makes sense because butterscotch is very sweet if you've ever had it before also main ingredient in butterbeer so stock up so all your friends can have a really good time downing some butterbeer all right so let's get to what the potion actually does Okay, so what butterscotch does is create that dwaddle draft potion. And this one is really important. It's kind of like a golden raspberry. In an encounter, it makes sure that the encounter doesn't run away. So kind of like Pokemon Run, encounters can fly away and basically escape. So this one decreases the chance and allows you to actually start casting a spell on different foundables in Wizards Unite. So it's definitely an important one. This particular potion you can't brew until level 17, which is a fairly high level. People are getting way past that very quickly, but for casual gamers, it may take a little bit longer for you to actually to reach level 17. So that being said, save up those butterscotches for when you actually get to level 17, because this will be a fairly important one to have if you're having trouble with them act with foundables actually leaving i don't know exactly what the rate i'm sure di like pokemon different foundables have different rates of fleeing so we'll have to see as we get more information on what types of encounters or foundables flee on you which ones will be best to use this potion on um, it does take six hours to brew which is a fairly long time compared to some of the other potions that we've taken a look at but overall Butterscotch is uh, one ingredient in this potion. I definitely suggest gathering up those butterscotches because hopefully they include butterbeer in the game and we're able to use some butterscotch for some butterbeer, if you know what I mean. So hopefully we get a little bit of that. And uh, yeah, that is butterscotch. So thanks for joining, guys. Really appreciate you guys watching. Give the video a like if you found that entertaining or informational because um, I hopefully these are very informational for you guys. Um, of course, if you guys have any ideas on future videos, definitely leave a comment or hit me up in my private Discord group. Would love to chat with you guys. So thanks for joining, and I will see you next time.